Hey folks, thanks for watching the video. I just wanted to show you real quick how I did this and beach surfing. Um, really cool program, really great for um, not just for making beats and rhythms and using drum samples, but also for creating interfaces for controlling your VSTs or even other apps in, um, on your iPad. I've used this for uh, doing basically the same thing you just saw, but using Thumb Jam and Sample Tank and any other number of instruments. And the beauty is you can send multiple MIDI channels to multiple instruments so you can control two or three things at a time. Uh, but in this case I was controlling uh, VSTs in Cubase. So um, I have four or five different things going on here just to show you real quick. I have a button and a volume slider that's controlling a synth sound. That was what you heard in the beginning. Um, then I have these buttons here which are controlling individual notes in these strips up here. So if I play, and I'll just bring the volume up here, if I play this I'm playing a C major chord which is actually triggering the C, E, and G up in these strips and, and basically setting these so each will play a different chord. And then on the right I am controlling single notes that I'm sending to multiple instruments in Cubase and um, basically have uh, about a three octaves worth of a scale here starting on low C the, the octaves are the green buttons there I've got some replication here and um, then the orange, orange keys are actually the chromatics so um, sharps And uh, so, yeah, really can, can uh, and the great thing about beat surfing is you can design your own in interfaces so you can control the spacing of the buttons and what they send to and what control surfaces you use and control change messages and everything else. So really great, great app, and um, I'll hope to post more soon, so I appreciate you watching. Thanks.